Uh-oh. Does the biggest school that's supposedly accredited uh, Roadmasters owned by Warner in some deep doo-doo that they don't want anybody to know about? Let's get into this. Allegedly, we have a new scandal on our hands. Um, you know, this person emails me and says, Hey, my, I've been trying to figure out how to contact you for a while now regarding an incident with my driving school, Roadmasters Driving School in Bethlehem, Pennsylvania. Two of the instructors were uh, CDL certified examiners and they cut corners pre-filled out paperwork, didn't conduct tests correctly, and were caught during an audit and fired. Now, hundreds of students uh, dating back two years, abandoning, spanning multiple states, are forced to go back and retest or lose their license, and you can only have one shot. You mess up under pressure, fail, and that's it. Back to square one. So the situation in hand is Roadmasters, people know, owned by Warner, um, definitely one of the biggest schools. Uh, you got to pay. I don't know. Let me know in the comments. I've heard anywhere between five to ten thousand uh, dollars for the school. And you know when they have these certified examiners, uh, pretty much at the end, they're the ones that can test you out. You know, and allegedly from this uh, whistleblower, they're pretty much saying that. Hey, they just got paperwork uh, from the Department of Transportation uh, from their state. I'm going to read this to you and show you this information that pretty much says that where they went to school is no good. And Roadmasters is supposed to be in this amazing school, right? And so now hundreds, uh, potentially thousands of truck drivers have to uh, retake their test. And second, if they don't pass, they have to go back to square one. You know, this isn't a situation where uh, these uh, truck drivers uh, were sneaking around. Uh, they didn't know any better. They thought that they were getting the correct training. You know, uh, let me read you this. This is actually from uh, Pennsylvania Department of Transportation. You know, uh, we blacked out all the information. It says, the Department of Transportation, PennDOT, has reasonably grounds to believe that your commercial driver's license was improperly issued because of third-party tester who initially administrated your CDL skills test was improperly conducting skills testing. As a result, um, PennDOT is requiring that you take and pass the CDL skills test with PennDOT exams to maintain your current CDL. If you do not, you will lose the CDL and PennDOT has issued to you. You know, and so they schedule a time and everything for this. So it's pretty crazy you know if i was a truck driver i've been trucking for two years and i get this note i would be pissed as heck you know and here's some more paperwork for you here this whistleblower actually gets a letter from roadmasters themselves that says we greatly appreciate your time and effort in working with us through this unfortunate cdl skills retesting process required by the pennsylvania department of transportation we understand the inconvenience this may have caused you and have worked hard to accommodate all affected individuals by providing refresher training facilities and equipment for use in retesting we understand that you may have concerns regarding impacts to your personal regarding the required retesting. If this is the case, you know, please email Roadmasters. So even Roadmasters is saying, hey, we're sorry about this. But I mean, hundreds of truck drivers are pissed, man. I mean, mother truckers, comment down below. What are your thoughts about this? If you were a truck driver that paid five to $10,000 and you thought you were getting the right training from a school and then you get this letter two years later, you know, just say two years later, you already bought yourself a truck, you're an owner operator, uh, you have yourself some loads, you have some customers, and now you have to redo all this. Your your business is on the line. I mean, this completely sucks. But, you know, uh, again, allegedly, 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 this is all paperwork. It looks real. Again, cannot confirm it. Uh, Mother Truckers, if uh, you are one of the people in this situation, comment down below or email me at mothertruckernews at gmail.com as well. But they are not making this public, of course, because it makes Roadmasters and Warner look completely bad. But hey, we're here. We're here to let people know the truth. So uh, Mother Truckers, comment down below and let me know your thoughts about this. But definitely, 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 I wouldn't be happy about it.